Hey guys, Andy Vidot from Atri Real Estate here in Cannington. Uh, just wanted to show you a new property that we've got coming to the market shortly. Um, would really make a good sort of, um, you know, first home or even uh, investment property. Um, so they're probably your, your two options there with, the, with this one. Um, look, really, uh, really good location. Uh, just down the end of the road there, you've got Bunnings, which um, as you, if you're familiar with Cannington, you would know just the other side of that is the, uh, the Car Westfield Carousel Shopping Centre. Um, so yeah, so really close to all your, all your amenities, everything through here as well, um, and also public transport. Um, but come through, we've basically got uh, 219 square metres here. Um, it's unit one, which is basically on the, on the street frontage, so you're not sort of tucked away. Um, and it's uh, on, um, yeah, so 219 square metres of land, which I mentioned. So come on through, you've got a, a double uh, lock-up garage through there. Um, we'll go through. Um, as you can see, you've sort of got your single door sort of entry. It does have its security grills and screens. Um, there is this little alfresco bit over the front as well, or portico, I should say, um, which just protects your front door a little bit as well. Um, as you come in straight away, there is um, just on the side here, there is this little um, linen cupboard or, or storage cupboard um, if you're just coming straight through the front door. So you can have a look at that. Uh, really nice, sort of just, um, you know, tiled floors, neutral colour in the paint. Um, through the hallway through. Um, as we come through, we've basically got um, your first bedroom through here. Uh, so you can see basically you've got ceiling fans with your light. Um, also, you have got a robe, so your, your robe's through there with the hanging rail as well. Oh. Um, come through. So directly across from the hall, you've got the second bedroom, uh, which once again has your ceiling fan, your lights, uh, you've got your window out into the little little courtyard space through there. Um, also, once again, does have a have a robe in this uh, in this bedroom as well. Um, and all hardwood, or sorry, all um, hard flooring. So there's no carpet or anything like that, which is once again really good for allergies, um, maintenance, cleaning, those sorts of things. Uh, you have got your common toilet through here with your exhaust fan, your light, um, and privacy door there. Uh, this is uh, probably the bigger one of, of the bedrooms, um, probably the master bedroom. So you can have a look through here. In this one, you'll see there is a light fitting there, but also there is the, the split system of heating and cooling as well. Um, all the bedrooms do have these blinds, so you can see that through there. Um, and same consistent flooring through the bedrooms as well. Um, so you've basically got your three bedrooms, uh, your, your toilet through there. Uh, then you've got your common bathroom. Um, now the common bathroom does have a toilet in as well, just behind uh, the main door. Uh, so you've got two toilets. Um, and then as you can see, nice tidy bathroom. Uh, you've got your shower screen, glass shower screen through there. Nice vanity, plenty of cupboards. Um, also your bathtub as well. See that? Uh, as we head sort of through this way, we've got, um, it's one of those laundries and it's just sort of safe spacing that's basically inside the um, inside the cupboard there. So you've basically got your laundry, uh, which basically your sink, as you can see the setup through there. There is a light and also an exhaust fan in there as well. So, um, and then that just tucks away nicely. Um, there you go. All right. um, you've got basically your, your main sort of living area through here as well with your uh, glass sliding door that goes out to your uh, fresco area, which we'll go out to in a minute. Um, other than that, you've got your kitchen, uh, which you can see through here. Once again, nice neutral colours. Uh, you've got a bit of stone on the bench tops. Um, your gas gas cooktop, electric oven, uh, range hood, as you can see. Uh, then your meals area. Um, and in this area as well, you can see there is another one of the split systems, uh, which basically cover the main living. So you've got your master bedroom and main living areas with the split systems. Um, and then the two minor bedrooms with your ceiling fans as well. Um, so and also has there is a gas bayonet for gas heating as well. So if you um, yeah if you like the gas heating that's there as well. Uh, there is this little private little courtyard as well just through here, um, which once again you know you can use this as a seat and chair or whatever. Or um, if you've got I don't know maybe cats or something you could use it as one of those cat enclosures or set it up as something like that. Um, really up to you with that space. But yeah it's a nice little private little space there. You can use that. Um, we'll go out to the main sort of outdoor space through here. So if you have a look, it's all uh, all really low, low maintenance, easy care. You've got basically your block paved through there. 
uh, nice um, gabled roof patio. Um, so you've got that as well. Um, we'll head through to this side, which basically will take you through to the, the garage uh, or whatever. You can see you've got your gas hot water system. Once again, your um, split system on the wall. Uh, and then you've got your the garaged area through here um, with your electric roller door or roller gate. Um, also, in this side, there is a storeroom. So quite quite generous size storeroom. So nice, no, you don't need any shed or anything like that. You've got this built into the to the main structure. So um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. All right, so that, that's pretty much the property here in Cannington. So look, if this property looks like something that may suit you or you you may have some interest in it, please feel free to contact me. More than happy to have a chat. Um, in fact, I'm looking forward to, to talking to you soon. Thank you.